we're not even two seconds in, and already this is hitting me so hard and how inaccurate this is to the source material. Death Note and the amazing Technicolor Dream logo. If you don't want to wind up on some kind of registry, I suggest you back the fuck! Abuse of the F word already. I'm looking at homework here for at least 15 different students. Are we really not going to discuss the fact that I have an ice pack on my face? The nurse says you'll be fine. Principal is a dick because he's a dick. Mia clearly has a boyfriend in this shot because hand over the shoulder in movies means they're clearly banging, but this dude straight up never comes up again in the whole film. And Mia has no problem hooking up with Light later in the film. Teacher is a dick because teacher is a dick. Also, Apple, look, it's symbolic because it represents forbidden knowledge and addiction and also just... Just give it the damn sin already. Light screams like a girl. And Light is still screaming like a girl. Why is this still going on? Oh my god, he's under the table. Overkill! Why do they live near a train? Is it because they're poor? Because this never comes up again, like, at all. Also, it's a small town and his dad has a pretty cushy job in the police department. I'm not saying being a single parent isn't hard, but there is no way this is the best they can afford. Just sit there saying the same bullshit about what? how people better I'm just gonna trust assume your aim. You're still pretty raw your... by what you saw today in school, and that's keeping you from thinking before you speak. I suggest you stop talking. Light's dad is a dick because he's a dick. Apples again. Look, ooh, symbolism of forbidden knowledge and just... Uh, <sighs> In the original, there's like 12 rules, plus there's like two that are made up, but that's for plot convenience. Why the hell are there 94 different goddamn rules for this book? This is only gonna serve to create as many plot holes as possible. This revenge plot ends far too quickly, like what's Light's motivation to keep using the book if he's a good, pure boy? Your poetry sucks. Why does this girl think this is poetry? Why does Light choose the most convoluted way to kill this guy? Why are they just chatting in public about this? Are Light's whole motivations to sleep with this girl? Oh my god, they are. I kid you not, this is where I had to finish the movie the first time I watched it because it was so awful of a twist. This scene does not contain a lap dance. Kira? What does that mean? Kira chooses his name rather than letting people choose his name already. Sets him up only to be a target later on in the film. Light is really dumb. Like, every action he makes is boasted by teen arrogance rather than being smart. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> look, it's an allusion to the original series, which is so much better. The insulin spike from the candies will focus your mind for final consideration. Why is the candy a subplot? A very go-nowhere one, but a subplot. Instead of, I don't know, the quirk that it was in the original. Also, sleep is key to strong thought. is supposed to be symbolic and have meaning, but it's never really explored in the movie outside of Watari. You're out of the woods, you're out of the dark, you're out of the night. This song should be symbolic because Elle is supposed to be enlightened, but because he goes insane later on, it makes no sense. This is 100% illegal. Also messed up because this is the police. Kira's in Seattle. How is it possible that Elle figures out Kira are involved with the police? In the show, Kira kills criminals only in international police know. What would you do if some guy fucked me? Oh, I'd kill him. Yeah? Yeah. And you kill him? Yeah. And kill him? Okay, yep. Yeah, Mia is messed up. Like, a goddamn sociopath. The individual known as Kira, as I'm sure you're aware, has taken credit for over 400 deaths. Oh, shit. While we don't know how he killed- Elle is also very dumb. Now I'm rooting for this guy. Hey, Ryuk, maybe offer the Shinigami eyes, a concept that enforces the idea of cause and consequence and balance. No, we're just gonna throw that awesome plot point out. Well, I guess probably gonna be a fight between those who wanna hang him and those who wanna dissect and figure out how he did it. Someone might try and kill Kira for killing people? Crazy. 
I'm gonna take five points because light cannot be possibly this stupid. You put someone on my kid? It's not personal, you're a cop. You should understand that the need for precaution. That's why you'd have to get rid of all the agents, regardless of who they're following. That way they wouldn't know who it was, but they would definitely know what happens when you fuck with Kara. Why are you dating this girl, Light? There's a guy in the news who killed a couple kids. I thought maybe we could make some popcorn and take some names down for later. Light is far too casual about murder. It's Netflix and chill, not Netflix and kill. One yeah, that son of a bitch killed them all. You? Not a public conversation. Do you think I'm some dog light? You can just snap your fingers and I'll come running? Also, yeah, you're supposed to follow the book owner around. <laughs> you could try. <laughs> but I warn you, there are four letters in my name. Most anyone's ever gotten were two. Somebody else wrote Ryuk's name twice in the book. Are you out of your mind? It's my fucking dad! Yeah, and he just dared us to kill him on live television. Light should murder his father. This is how the Shin should go, because he shouldn't care for anyone. We're not the good guys anymore. Okay, morally conscious Light. You think you're better than me, but you're just trying to kill Kira. No. Kira, Kira! This is a confession. Light, I don't even carry a gun. It's distracting. Foreshadowing. I promise. I was just, I was scared, okay? You think I'm not scared? I get it. Love blinds all and makes people do irrational things, and power isn't a corrupting force, but love is, and I just... This movie is dumb. The power should be absolutely corrupt corrupting light, not the love he has for Mia. It should be the other way around. Atari becomes obsessed with revealing the true identity of the detective known as L. For the next 48 hours, he will cease all communication with the outside world, except to update what he learns to the number 206-555-0166. At 7 p.m. on October 12th, he dies. This is ridiculously overly complicated of a plot. And an idea. And a plan. For the first test, the wards were placed in a conditioning vault. Those who retained their sanity after seven months were initiated into the pro- This is child torture. Elle is on the wrong side of all sides. And you don't need to help me. Light is a dick because he's a dick. It's cool too much later. Have you ever heard of the concept what works in animation doesn't always work in real life? Why do they keep pronouncing Watari wrong? El should not be freaked out as he is. James, this is incredibly illegal and not okay. He is a search team and a warrant. Know what happens when they find it. It ends up my book again, Light. And guess what name I'm gonna suggest we start with when I find it a new home. You're required by the rules to kill him, Ryuk. How did the search teams not notice me at Give me the New York field office. Now! Yes, L. Yell your way to victory. Works every time. Hey, are you Watari? I am Watari. Watari. They use us Machina. Ah, you said dealer's choice. <laughs> Ryuk should not be a villain. Light Turner's heart stops beating at midnight. Mia, what the actual hell is wrong with you? Why the hell would you try to kill Light? There's so many fucking rules. You and me both, Light. I cannot begin to explain how much I hate this scene. The blatant racism, the complete lack of regard for theme or power, redu reducing the concept of the Death Note down to a nothing more than a boring, flat, vengeance begets vengeance story. A lot of it is what makes this movie the worst movie of all time. In this one scene alone. In a little... <laughs> Deus Ex Machina. Again. Light will for a fact be arrested for her after this. We gotta, gotta stop doing all this. Light, now is not the time for moral conscious. You're way past that line. Plea for love doesn't work with power, idiot. What are you You say you love me? I thought you wouldn't take the book! Straight up, Light, you killed her. This is your fault. Her blood is in your hands. I cannot believe this is real. But none of that's gonna help you if we see you around. Oh, L messed up, right? Okay, sure. Besides the dozens of other criminals he's stopped, one albeit massive mistake and he's out is kind of a ridiculous idea. Dr. Norman Ludlum, known for sexually assaulting female patients under sedation, 
On the night of October 12th, Norman Ludlam is present at the pier when two individuals fall from the northwest Ferris wheel. This is actually a smart idea and sticks very well to the original. L cannot use the notebook at all. <laughs>